Good evening. First, it was the brawl after the rivalry game. Now the feud may be escalating between Volcano Vista and Cibola. Volcano Vista just hit hard by vandals. And we've learned the next basketball game between the two schools could be played in an empty gym. News 13's Jackie Kent is live on the west side at Volcano Vista with the latest. Jackie. Jessica Dean students showed up this morning to find graffiti. Lots of it. This is the schools try to figure out how to handle the rivalry game next week. Basketball game brawl in the Volcano Vista parking lot after the two school rivals met last week. Then both Volcano Vista and Cibola canceled their winter dances for safety reasons. And today, lewd pictures and obscene messages spray painted around the Volcano Vista campus. APD says it's unclear if it's connected to the ongoing feud with Cibola, but the number of incidents stacking up has students concerned about what's next for this high school rivalry. I think. It could go further just because kids want more attention. To get to, to this extent, it's too much. This week, Volcano Vista's principal emailed parents about her upcoming meeting with Cibola leadership to make decisions about security plans for upcoming games, like the rematch with Cibola February 9th at Cibola's gym. We've learned one of the possibilities is banning fans from the game. It happened before when a rivalry crossed the line. In 2010, APS and the NMAA had the Los Lunas and Rio Grande girls basketball teams play in an empty gym. That set the precedent. NMAA Executive Director Sally Marquez says they make those decisions with school districts on a case-by-case -case basis when there's a security concern. The NMAA says as of now, APS has not reached out to the organization to get involved, and the school district has also not confirmed if the principals met to discuss the no crowd option. Jessica, back to you. All right, thank you, Jackie. There is also talk of banning chants, signs, and heckling aimed at the fans of the other team.